Welcome back. State Emergency Service volunteers are calling on residents to prepare homes and emergency kits before it's too late. SES says while fine weather persists, conditions are ideal to get housekeeping up to date ahead of the cyclone season. Cyclone Marsha left a trail of devastation in her wake. The unpredictability of the Category 5 system highlighting the need to plan ahead. Rockhampton wasn't actually really prepared for it because um, a lot of the stuff that we saw there were uh, damage to roofs, a lot of debris, um, there were a lot of trees down. Eight months on, state emergency services are getting ready for the next weather event. They're asking residents to do the same. Make sure that you have a plan. Make sure that your house is prepared so your gutters have been cleaned because that's the major problem of uh, roof damage in a heavy rain. Inside the home, the message is similar. This is a sample of a well-stocked emergency kit. Everybody's kit's going to be a little bit different, but I think the basics are you need food and water for at least three days. That's a minimum of 10 litres per person, or eight of these containers. Double-checking last year's supplies are still in working order is also on the radar. Every year I go through all of my batteries, and this year most of them happen to be dead, so I was able to um, plan for that and get them replaced. As for what not to do, complacency is high on the list. The worst thing at this time of the year is when it starts, the humidity starts to increase. Um, so Mother Nature is actually building up for the storm season. The calm before the storm that could make a difference. Sasha Passy, Wind News.